Hi, this is Charlotte from Petomation. In this video, I will show you how Petomation can turn your analytical project from this into this. Let's get started and let's see how we can make Petomation work for you. With virtual microscopy, you can scan slides and turn them into gigapixel images. The resulting data file is referred to as a whole slide image or a WSI. In order to make it manageable, a grid can be placed over it to cut it in bite-sized pieces. One of these pieces is typically called a tile. Many people are working on extracting knowledge out of these tiles. The possibilities are endless. You can train an algorithm to find basic features like blood vessels or epithelial tissues, but also detect whether a slide contains necrotic tissue or even if a tumor is present. Where the magic happens is typically an analytical engine that's the result of a research project. There are many technologies you can use for this, like scikit-learn, TensorFlow, PyTorch, etc. Of course, you don't use all of these libraries. You typically settle on just one. And just as you settled on one specific programming library, Petomation offers a universal tile server called PMA Core. When you put PMA Core in front of your analytical engine, you suddenly make it applicable to not just one, but all available scanners on the market. Correspondingly, Petomation offers PMA Studio, which has a panel-oriented layout. The organization of the panels is fully configurable via XML, as is the ribbon. And last but not least, custom panels can be added and integrated into the standard layout schemes. When you opt for PMA Studio, your end-user experience becomes richer and instantly gains a range of professional features like multi-slide grid viewing and real-time conferencing. In short, your next analytical engine should run on top of the Petomation platform for digital pathology and virtual microscopy.